please hit subscribe and change it to past tense. Hi Speechies, it's Lisa. Welcome back to Speech Fairies. Today I have a learning resources toy. This is the Moving Monkeys Building Set. It develops critical thinking and fine motor skills. So it is part of the STEM line that they're pushing now, the Science, Technology, Engineering, and Math. So this toy has been around for a while, but now it will have... This is their STEM logo, ages four and up. There's the model number if you're interested. And it was $5.99, I found it thrifting. So it says, swing into engineering with this open-ended building set. Get your monkey spinning, turning, and moving. Mix and match to make endless new creations. Work with all Gears, Gears, Gears building sets. So those are all the Gears, Gears, Gears from Learning Resources. Activity guide with building instructions included. It says 103 pieces. And I am curious to see if we got it all. Stay tuned. I'll also try to put the price that this is regularly on the screen as well. You'll be opening it up at the same time as I am, so we'll see what we got. There could be anything in here. That was the moment of truth. So we have these base pieces. There's five stuck together right there. I'll add another one or two. A couple more in there. Sneak right in. I don't see the instructions in here, but I do see some fun monkeys, and palm trees, and lots and lots of gears. So let's pull these monkeys out first. Super cute. Not sure if there's any more in here. I'll show you one close up with those cute little faces. So here's one of the monkeys. You can see they're really cute. And you can hook them on. And there's his bum little tail. I wish I knew how many were supposed to be in here. This one's left some of the pieces quite intact so we can just kind of build them up and see what we have what happens. Here's a stem of a tree. Goes right in the hole. Put this one inside so we can do a big tall gear tree. It looks pretty fun. Looks like you can build it in different ways. I think I would have to go on the web and print out some instructions for this one. The nice thing is, with these toys, you're not supposed to put them together to kind of match. Not like Lego where you try to follow every step exactly until you get the end product. The whole idea with these is to get creative and try different things and troubleshoot and get kids thinking kind of outside the box. This one's interesting. It looks kind of like the windmill would eventually turn if we got things lined up the right way. That's cute. This piece looks interesting. We've got two gears and they're connected by a vine. So we can kind of cross over a little bit. It's like a big jungle flower. There are palm tree piece. Oh, and here's also something to wind them with. We can get the whole thing going if we can connect all the gears. So, I tried to make the one on the box. I didn't last very long, but it's not my forte. But I wanted to try anyway to see how it would turn out. And it works! So this is just a little small one. Try this and see. So the monkey does get closer and closer to the end, and once he gets to the end, you can go backwards and he moves around. So let's see how happy he is. Oh yes, he's had a grand old time. So that is just an example of what you can build with it. Once you get going, you kind of get the idea of what you need to kind of, this needed a little bit of height to turn. And these spacers are the ones you can add extra gears to. So yeah, overall, pretty good set. I'm happy with the number of pieces I got. Somewhere between 80 and 103. I didn't get them all, but I got enough to get going anyway. To 
try it and see if it's something my preschoolers can do. So thanks for hanging out and finding out with me. If you like this little video, please give us a thumbs up, comment down below your thoughts, and don't forget to hit subscribe and ring the little bell. Thanks for watching and we'll see you very soon. Bye for now everyone.